everybody, Boon Driver here, back with another video. It, I'm your favorite guy for virtual reality, Fortnite, live streams, and Steam games. So, and also more, guys. All right, so it's so today we, me, and I think at least 12 people have been working on this huge team. But I'm gonna do this with the myself and the other person that helped out the most. So. Um, it's actually, in case you did not read the title or see the thumbnail somehow, it's, uh, the block on Fortnite. So, in case you do not know what the block is, the block is a, is, well, first off, it replaced Risky Reels. Um, so it's now a place where if, in creative, in the brand new Fortnite creative mode, people will be able to make their own creations and it will be featured on the Fortnite map and you'll get a hard plug. So... You boy need that plug, all right? Anyways, guys, comment down below what battle pass tier you are. I am currently tier 95, uh, five tiers away from the Ice King, guys, and I've done all of my challenges. Uh, obviously, I've done all my challenges. Otherwise, I wouldn't be at this. Also, did get the bundle. Um, almost that cat flip. Anyways, let's get right into it. So, um, so this is my friend here, say hello. Hello. Uh, his channel will be linked in the description down below. Um, so I want you guys to go subscribe to him, subscribe to me, and subscribe to PewDiePie. Alright? All three links will be linked down below. So we finally loaded in, guys. And, uh, before we load in, I'm going to, or before, before we go into the actual game, I'm going to go tell you guys what, wow, um, what this map is called. And it's actually called Premium Plaza, so that kind of gives you a small hint at what it is. Or actually, it's a huge hint at what it is. <laughs> Sorry. But, I hope you all, um are as pumped as I am to show you guys. Alright. So, load in here. Uh, take a second to load in, guys. Alright. Alright, it takes a while to load in. Because it's such a huge, huge um, creation. But... Oh, crap. Okay. So, as you can see, this is the main plaza area, that's like the center right, so of everything. Should we do like, smallest to largest, or should we do the apartment first? I think we should do the apart- Yeah, let's do the apartment first, alright guys. So, as you can see, this is- I'll fly out from the big part. As you can see, there's a little tornado that went on here, that's why this building's having to get rebuilt. And that's why there's yeah. a tree! So yeah, they're still recovering from that up there. You'll, uh, I'll get more in depth into that later. But so here is the apartment slash hotel lobby. We're not sure, but uh, this is where you check this in. Is... Uh, this is like the, kind of a lounge area. There's some bookshelves right here. Yeah, this is the shady gathering area. Yeah, it's where all the people play poker. Basically, uh, there's a mini noms, uh, a big shot espresso, and a bookstore uh, because it's an apartment, self-functioning kind of. So, we'll go up here. Up the shady staircase. Up the shady staircase. So, um, these are more of the studio apartments. So, e every single room is decorated with uh, bedding, couch, TV, toilet, stove, Ash fridge, kitchen. Um, every single room, guys. So, uh, time-wise, this has taken us... Probably would you say four weeks, four or yeah, five weeks. About four. We started, five, yeah, about yeah, four or five Something weeks. Like that. Um, but we've had a team of twelve people working on it. But me and my friend here, we've been the main people. We've been grinding this place to get it out for you guys. Uh, so right here, this is a little like um ATMs and some vending machines. And over here is the snobby shore style bathroom. Yeah, there's a snobby short style bathroom over here. Sit um, on the toilet and look out that window. Yep. Beautiful view with the toilet, guys. Beautiful, beautiful view. 
just looks <laughs> out. That's probably the ocean, I would say. Yeah, and everyone can watch you, too. <laughs> yep. So if we mm -hmm. come out through this area over here... So this area is uh, another floor, but these these are the huge, big, rich boy. There's one rich boy in each apartment. Huge bed, paintings all across the walls, lamps on the wall, a dead antler of or some <coughs> lamps, more paintings, huge TV, luxury bathroom, mirrors above all the restrooms, every single room, luxury right here. <laughs> We got have, like, a ton of ATMs so many ATMs. You know, you want to say why we got all the ATMs? The rich boys, you know. Yep, the rich boys. And He's these vending them. machines double the price of the studio apartments up here. Same exact stuff, double the price because they're richer. So why not? So um, right here, some fancy, mo a little own little room. So each one's a little bit custom. That's uh, your normal guy apartment and. Yeah, out those here. are some normal more apartments. Um, out here, here though, this, this one, one has like right a here. yeah, this one has like a theater kind of mini theater. I know some rich people have those uh, paintings all across the beds again, uh, toilet, bathroom, etc. Now these two rooms are not normal. As we walk in here, oh boy, some crazy person lives here. Uh, three random Thanks. couches, no TV, lockers, a, a bunch of... I can only assume this is not money. Uh, <laughs> books, and yeah. We so, gotta go to the super shady guy, though, over here. So, yeah. this... These people are still moving in, but uh, I'd like to say this is more infested by rats. That's why no one lives here. As you can see, yeah, beautiful God. power outlets to plug your phone in. I do not like outlets. Okay, we'll lock you in there for now. So, Yo. one floor above Restra that, there's actually a um, little... Restaurant, kind of. Yeah, a restaurant. Uh, you guys have no idea how long it took to place these booths, guys. I think we... Did we spend, like, a whole day on this kitchen? Like, we spent at uh, least 12 hours up here. So, uh, booths. We did not spend 12 hours. <laughs> yeah, we did. This this took this one took a while. Uh, it's buffet with the menus up there. A bit of the trees hanging through the ceiling, but um, more. This is more fish stuff, and then we have this ginormous kitchen, humongous kitchen, guys. Ooh, I have a build battle. And then, so as you can see, this is where the tree is. So they're they're going to be rebuilding this floor, guys. So, let's get back downstairs. Alright guys, so that was the office building. And we're going to be looking at the uh, pub that was completely destroyed by the tornado that came through. That's also what put the tree up there, by the way. Lots of mats. Lots, lots of mats here. Uh, we got some porta potties Overall, completely unfinished. There might be more pallets when it gets put in. So. Yeah, could be more pallets. We don't know, but um, overall, just completely unfinished. Not, not a huge. No one's gonna really land here. Oh, everyone's gonna land here. Probably a whole squad couldn't move that all. Yeah, um, uh, more than a squad, dude. Yeah. So let's get. Um, this so is like this the is mall. Like a, yeah, this is a mall. Uh, there has all the stores. Yeah, that this are is here. all the stores. Uh, there's Joelle's Big Shots, Noms. Um, uh, Guffins. Uh, the Joelle's is definitely a miniature version. But... Yeah, and Big Shot Espresso. So it's a mini Joelle's. So as you walk in the mall, it is mostly just tables and stuff. There's the Joelle's pub right here. That's obviously one uh, from Save the World. So it's a little bit of crossover. I, I don't know. I kind of think thought that would be a nice touch. Uh, those are the menus right there. Um, this is Joelle's in. Ben, this is Joelle's in Tilted, you know? Yeah, yeah, I know that, but it's most, it's mostly, it's a storyline in Save the World. So, okay. um, you. Here's the restrooms. Yeah, yeah, here are the restrooms, boys and girls, of course. Mhm. Mm um. So this is the McGuffin's bookstore. It's a little broken down because, let's be honest, who reads books anymore? 
Um, so as you can see, this is all the comics and the books and more books and more books. Let's be honest, it's a bookstore, nothing interesting. Uh, that's where cash register out. So this is the bigger noms over here. This is the Big Shot Espresso. So it's kind of like a Starbucks. It's in the mall. Here's the nom. So in the noms, there's a bunch of- We did of... accidentally place an item spawner here. Yeah, it won't break. It's and stuck. Yeah, it's weird, but it, it's if it gets added stuck. in, it will be removed. So. Yeah. Yes. That was me, and we wanted to do a 1v1, so I put a weapon down. And yeah. yeah. But, um, so right here, this is more food, 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 seafood, salads, uh, you got, um, vending machines, or sodas, and then you got some ice, too, and uh, all the cash registers, so, yes. So, and then there's also a water tower in the back here, and some ATMs in front of the... Uh, back so of course all the concrete that is on the block will be replaced with grass guys so anyways I want to thank all of you guys for watching and leave a like if you can see this being added in for a possible block feature because I think it has a great chance I really enjoy it mm -hmm. and I think it would be really cool it would be a really hot uh, drop guys so, also, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!